Hey everybody, this is Jim at Juggernaut Tactical. Today we're going to be going over a California compliant kit. Today we're going to show you how to disassemble that rear takedown pin so you can adjust the magazine lock. So, we're going to start by disassembling that rear takedown pin. Counterclockwise, twist it off. Then we have it pulled off, set to the side. You're going to push it just a little bit. You're going to go ahead to this side. While keeping pressure on both the upper and the lower, you're going to look it tells you what direction, so you're going to pull it towards you, just about a quarter of a click, and you're going to pull out all the way, just like a normal rear takedown pin. So now it's all the way pulled out. Now you can break the upper lower down. So now we have that magazine lock. If this is not adjusted properly, you will not be in California compliance. So make sure you do take the time to properly adjust this to make sure the magazine will not fall out unless the upper and lower are broken away. So here, we're going to go ahead and start by just tightening it, just about a quarter of a turn at a time. Alright, so now we're going to close the upper and lower, while keeping pressure on both the upper and lower so we can insert that rear takedown pin. We're going to push it in gently until it stops, then you're going to twist away from you to get that final locking turn in. Now you're going to make sure that this magazine still does not release because we tightened it. So now we're going to push that button. And there we go, it is now releasing. So now we can put the spring loaded part back on this side. Give that tight. We're going to push this button. Here we go, showing you how it breaks from the upper and lower. Now you can use that magazine release button freely. Insert the new magazine, tap it and go. Stay tuned for our next video for complete installation from a factory rear take down pin to the new Dragonaut Tactical, Hellfire, California Compliant, Take Down Pin, and Magazine Lock. Thank you.